So I like to use some good old fashioned cross fibre friction here and you've got a lovely area to work. So the spongy area here at the top of the scapula there, you can feel the scapular cartilage and you've got all the attachment site for the muscles through there. And I like to just work with some cross fibre friction with the pads of my four fingers starting at the thoracic portion of the trapezius and then working up over the top of the scapular cartilage and rounding a bit of a half moon shape into the cervical trapezius and obviously hitting through the splenius and the rhomboid attachment site and you can really just feel the tissue that feels stuck initially and hardened just get a little bit of fluidity and move and anybody can do this and the horse really enjoys this release so that's going dorsal ventral up and down you can also swap hands and then just start to go the other way so caudal cranial so back and forth parker's a huge fan of this back and forth and you can just use the top of the scapula the scapula cartilage as a bit of a map to trace around and then you really do, you can see the tissue, the myofascial release that you get. Things are just starting to move and become more pliable. So you can get this area really soft and anybody can do this technique to really help them through there. Good boy. So we're getting a lick and a chew and the eyes rolling. It's a superb release and again you're affecting the shoulder, the neck and the back. <laughs>